Hello everybody, this is Patrick Butler and this is going to be a special what I got video and it's going to be a huge unboxing video. Now I will say this, that even though it's going to be huge, I reopened it and there's a reason because when I got it the box must have ripped so I opened it immediately <laughs> surprisingly enough I won't be uh, opening the box however though I don't know what most of the contents are and the person that sent me this huge package was It's Frank and you can check out his channel right now and he's using a new program that allows him to actually have better quality with his videos and surprisingly enough I like the sound to it because back when he was starting out with his webcam or whatever or not he usually uses a webcam and he used to do uh, YouTube capture I, I think that's what it was called YouTube webcam capture but they're stopping the use of it or they already stopped the use of it so what he did was he got a new program that allows him to use his webcam for videos and it works actually awesome it, and the sound quality is actually really good so check out his channel I'll put a link down below in the description box and hopefully you'll enjoy his videos now he sent me a package that was for my birthday and you're going to see what that content is today on this episode of What I Got. Now, the package that It's Frank sent me was so heavy and so huge that a couple of the corners of the box ripped. So, because I was so afraid that all my stuff was going to go out of the box I just opened up the package so that way nothing would go flying and, and nothing would get damaged and surprisingly enough Frank actually sent this huge package in it and it almost cost 20 bucks for shipping which I'm surprised that he paid that much and I did not expect to have a huge package I thought it was only gonna be one gift and that was it but surprisingly enough it wasn't so I'm gonna show you what I got today now I know some stuff that was in the package I only know some of the stuff though however you don't know yet I'm gonna show what I actually got first that I do know about and then I'm gonna show you the stuff that I don't know anything about yet so let's get to it now the stuff that I already know what it is is inside this bag and I'm gonna reveal it right now first off this is a Sonic dog tag from Sonic Boom and this is a Knuckles dog tag from Sonic Boom this is a Sonic Magnet this is a inside out button and of course I do like inside out it's actually a very very enjoyable movie definitely check it out and finally I got a book and it's the history of Sonic the Hedgehog and it's a pretty nice book it's the soft cover edition there's also a hard cover edition as well now I'm done with the stuff that I already know about. Now I'm going to see for the first time some of the stuff that I don't know that I got. And I'm going to see what it is. This feels like a Blu-ray. This I don't know. Okay. Alright. Frank got me the Rocketeer 20th Anniversary Edition which I do like this movie I haven't seen it in a very long time so thank you very much Frank for that I've never 
actually had this. That's one of the things I don't have, so thank you very much, Frank. And finally, what's this? Oh, it's another Rocketeer thing. But this time it is a book by IDW it's called Rocketeer by Dave Stevens. And I've never seen this book. It's a, it, 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 it looks like a graphic novel, which is pretty cool. That I did not know what it was. So thank you very much, Frank, for that. Now, the next load of stuff is in this bag, of course. Now, of course, I've actually seen Axe Cobb on, uh, on FXX, and it's usually late night on Thursday, I believe. I think it's still on, but I'm not sure. And there's another side of the bag that says, uh, what's it? This I never heard of. High School USA. Never heard of that one. But there's stuff in this bag, so let's get to it. Holy moly! This. <laughs> oh, Frank. I never expected you to get me these. Holy moly. We got Peanuts comic books. Holy <laughs> cow. So we got issues 19. 20. I'll now show 20 here. Okay, so that's 20, 21, 22. There's a lot in here. 23, 23, 24. Holy moly. That's a lot. 25, holy cow. That, that, that's 25. There's, there's a lot of them. I will say that, Frank. 26? There's a lot that you got me, Frank. 27, it looks like 28 is the last. 27, holy cow. And 28, okay. And that is a lot of Peanuts comic books. Holy cow, Frank. Hopefully I can get covers for these. Because I did not expect you to get me Peanuts comic books, for real. I never ex I've heard of these. I've heard of these, Frank. But I never expected you to get me any of these. Now, the next one is in this FYE bag. I used to go to FYE, actually, Frank. You probably didn't know that for sure. I just wanted to let you know. And everybody else. So, here we go. I'm open it up since I know some of the stuff, but I just haven't looked. Okay, we got Rocky and Bullwinkle Classics. Star Billing. That looks pretty cool. It's by IDW. It's another graphic novel, it looks like. I'm not sure. I'll set that right over here. And this is the Sonic the Hedgehog one. This is the beginning, which is pretty cool. And finally, here's another Sonic the Hedgehog one. And this is a hardcover book. It's called Super Interactive Annual 2014. And it's done by Pedigree. And it looks... I'm not sure if it's an activity book or whatever or not. It looks pretty cool. It looks pretty cool, so. Now, this is the last bag that I have to show. It shows Lucifer, which is a new show on Fox. And it's supposed to air pretty soon, but I'm not sure when. Oh, that's pretty cool. I do like, I did like the X-Files back in the day, Frank. I just wanted to let you know. Because I know that the X-Files... It, it probably it, and by the way, it probably will air after this is uploaded. I know that after the NFC Championship game, I believe they're going to show the X Files on Fox. So that is pretty cool, and and I believe that this episode of what I got will air after the 
season premiere of the reboot of the X-Files. So. Now I'm going to show what I got in this bag. And... It'll, okay. There's a couple of... Uncle Scrooge by IDW. A couple under uh, Uncle Scrooge graphic novels. And there is a couple. Well, hold on a minute. I didn't. Okay. I thought there was going to be another Donald Duck one. This is the only Donald Duck one that I, I see that you got me, Frank. Also by IDW. And, surprisingly enough, there's another IDW one. This is Mickey Mouse. And finally, and guess what? I didn't expect you to get me this, Frank. And, and I knew about this. This is the only DuckTales graphic novel by Kaboom. Yeah, because there were only a few issues, issues of DuckTales by Kaboom and what ended up happening was Ka Kaboom lost its contract with Disney to actually do these so that's the reason why Kaboom doesn't do Dick Disney stuff anymore but I just wanted to point that out this is the only graphic novel that was ever released of DuckTales which is unfortunate because I would have loved to have seen more comic books of DuckTales by Kaboom but that's okay. So that is the last bag. Now I'm going to get to the stuff that are wrapped because the thing about it is Frank en ended up sending me a couple of gifts that are wrapped. So I don't know what they are. And I just couldn't believe that Frank would actually send me a couple of gifts that were wrapped. But the thing about it is it was my birthday so I'm going to start with this one. There's actually two wrapped. And I don't know what this is, so I'm going to open it on camera. Okay. As you can see, I'm opening it right now. Okay. Here's what Frank got me. He got me Twice Upon a Time, which I've never seen. It's from the Archive Collection by Warner Brothers. And finally, the Super 6, the series. Which i also never seen. It's, by, it, it's actually done by a different company, surprisingly enough. By TGG Direct. Even though this was done by... Uh, maybe it was done by Metro Golden Mirror, I don't know. But that Super 6... The series and Twice Upon a Christmas. That's the only two DVDs that I got. Now, the final thing that I'm going to show is this. Yeah, and now I'm going to open this. And I think I know what this is because Frank actually told me one of the gifts that I'm going to get. But I wasn't sure which one it's going to be. So I'm going to open it right now. He still he sealed it pretty good. Okay, let's see what it is. Holy moly! No, I did not expect this to be two Blu-rays. Now, I know for a fact that Frank actually got me this. This, of course, is a Latin. And I didn't care if he was going to get me the Digibook version. I could have even gotten the Digibook version. Or, or this one. It didn't matter. This, is, of course, is the Diamond Edition of Latin. And the thing about it is, I haven't been collecting Diamond Edition since Lady in the Tram. But the good thing is, I at least have this, and I do like this movie. And I actually went to go see it at the drive-thru at one time. And the final thing, and I did not expect this, is a two-movie collection. And it's actually The Return of Jafar and Aladdin and the King of Thieves. I did not expect this though. So I got not only the first movie, I actually got the sequels. So that is pretty cool, Frank. And that is all for what I got in the huge box 
that Frank actually gave me. It's a Uber. It was Uber, I should say. And the one that usually says Uber is usually Zarin Isaac. So I'm going to give a shout out to him as well because he's definitely got a nice channel and definitely check his videos out. So not only will I be uh, posting a link to Frank's channel, but I'm also going to post a link to Zarin Isaac's channel as well. So ex please subscribe. I will tell you that. You will definitely won't be disappointed with those two. Now the last thing I'm going to show is the card that Frank gave me. And I'm going to open it right now. Frank has actually sent me a card before. That was Chris, uh, it was actually uh, almost Christmas of 2014 when he sent it. Along with a huge box. But I don't think the box was as huge as this one that he sent me. This was a huge uber birthday box essentially okay let's see what the card is it is your big day and hopefully you can see that hopefully the glare did not make it unreadable open this up and it says wishing you a birthday filled with nice surprises and all your favorite things. Happy birthday from It's Frank. So, thank you very much, Frank, for the card, along with the gifts that you sent me. And, of course, you've told me about Darkwing Duck becoming a comic book again. I, I know because the, the fact is, I've heard about it. And I know originally that Kaboom actually had the rights to Darkwing Duck back in the day. But no longer because Disney decided to uh, cut ties with Kaboom. And that's what happened. By the way, Frank, I gotta show you this. This you've probably never seen. This is a Dale pin that I actually got from Disney World back in 2005. And it was fun going to Disney World back then. I went with my family. And it was really fun. And I got a couple more pins. Now, you know for a fact that you are starting a pension for releasing the Disney Afternoon shows on DVD. Because we didn't get all of them uh, complete on DVD yet. Hopefully, in the near future, we will get that. And hopefully, I hope they release Chippendale Rescue Rangers Volume 3 because I'd like to see that one episode that was cut on Too Dizzy to actually be uncut. Someday, I'm going to do a Rant Files video about that cut version from Toon Disney because the thing about it is I did not like what happened. You'll find out someday what it is. You'll... you'll I, I, I will let you know that I'll be doing a Rat Files video about it because it, it, it was a huge complaint. And the thing about it was I did not like when one of the episodes was cut. But that's all I really got to say. And for the rest of you, check out Frank's channel. And you can also check out Zarin Isaac's channel. I'll put a link down below in the description of his channel as well. But that's pretty much it, and I'd like to thank you very much, Frank, for sending me all of the gifts that were in that Uber box, for sure. And it was a huge box, and so heavy that it practically ripped the box. So I actually opened up the box beforehand and took all of the gifts out before anything happened to the box. So... It's unfortunate that I had to open up the box because it was so heavy and part of the box ripped. So, that's what happens. So that's it for this special episode of What I Got. I'd like to thank you very much for watching. And please definitely check out Frank's channel and Zara and Isaac's channel. The links to their channels are down below in the description box, along with this petition that Frank made of the Disney Afternoon Shows on DVD. If you're interested, please sign. And if you are interested in the entire, and I mean this, entire 
Disney afternoon shows, every single one of them, and I'm talking about Gummy Bears, Chippendale Rescue Rangers, DuckTales, Darkwing Duck, and there's a couple of more that I just can't think of. If you're interested, definitely, definitely sign, for sure. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. Peace out, and I will catch you next time. Goodbye, everybody, and peace out.